Hello guys welcome back to another video, this is you Mechanow. today is the light novel chapter 80 the incident before the banquet, if you guys like the video make sure to like and subscribe and hit the bell now let's get into the video. The incident before the banquet the demon lord's banquet, Walpurgis. The people who participated in the banquet were the current nine demon lords. And the most prominent figure at the banquet was the one who had just transcended into the realm of demon lords. The participants were listed below demon race, dark emperor, lord of darkness, guy crimson. Fairy race, pixie, labyrinth fairy ramrus. Dragonoid race, tyrant of destruction, destroyer, milum nava. Giant race, Wrath of the Earth, Earthquake, Dagruel. Vampire, Queen of Evil Night, Queen of Nightmares, Rumina's Valentine. Fallen Angel Race, Sleeping Ruler Dino. Winged Race, Harpy, Sky Queen Free. Undead Race, Marionette Master Clayman. Former Human, Blonde Demon Leon Cromwell. The seating order around the round table was decided based on the order in which they become Demon Lords. There was one vacant seat, and a Temporary seat was prepared at the lowest position. Guided by the maids, each demon lord would take their respective seat. At that silent hall, in the middle of the room, that separated from the outside world were three people. They were already seated on their own seat and were waiting for the arrival of the other demon lords. Those three were Guy, Leon, and Ruminas. Then, some noisy people invaded the room, penetrating the silence. Y-A-H-O-O -O, you guys healthy? A fairy flew quickly to her seat while saying those words. It was Ramrus. Long time no see. A giant greeted everyone and sat down on his seat. It was Dagruel. Yo, as usual, you people all seem rather gloomy. Calling and teasing the pretty girl with silver hair next to her seat. It was Dino. Naturally, there was no response. Only an unpleasant glare. The one who followed after the three demon lords was the newcomer. The main actor of the banquet had arrived. The first three who were already on their seats concentrated their glares at Ramuru's arrival. One person looked interested. One person looked uninterested. One person looked with hatred on its eyes. However, the person under their gaze didn't greet anyone, and so he was guided to the temporary seat and sat down on it. With this, there were three remaining demon lords that had yet to arrive. The mood was oppressive as the demon lords waited for all members to be present. Their attendants were waiting at the back. For some reason, the three people who were standing behind Dino and Dagruel looked like they had been beaten up badly, but no one mentioned anything about it. They seemed to want to say something, but were completely ignored. Just before the appointed time for the banquet to begin, three demon lords entered simultaneously. The host of this banquet was Clayman, and, including the two demon lords that entered with him, all members were present. At that moment, in front of the demon lords who were waiting for the opening statement of the Walpurgis banquet, a surprising incident happened. Clayman raised his fist and struck Milam. Walk quickly, you dim wit. To use such violent words towards Milam was a death sentence. Seeing this incident, everyone was awestruck. To the one named the tyrant Milam, this countered all logical sense. Alas, that idiotic guy, he's done for. And yet, even after committing such a violent act towards Milam, Clayman didn't show any remorse. Milam wasn't resisting, and without any complaint, she just sat there on her seat. This situation could be considered very strange. The other demon lords couldn't believe what had just occurred. Thus, though foreshadowing ill omened events to come, the Walpurgis banquet began. While Dino was sitting on his seat, he was thinking about the monster he had met earlier. A rather intriguing monster. Also, Dino sensed a comparable strength to his own emanating from him. He wasn't like the feeble Clayman. He had the true demon lord's ambition. How interesting. Holding the unique skill sloth he was nearly finished with depraving Dagruel. He was a truly uncontrollable person, who held an overwhelming power, so Dino has been avoiding having serious battles against him. Just as the skill name suggests, containing the word sloth, 
The skill power was meant to deprave in nature after his son who will succeed his throne, the depraving will be completed. His sons had enough qualification to become a demon lord. After they receive enough experience then they will become one. Then, Dagrul would retire, and it would become what Dino had planned before. Unique skill sloth power was to cause the depraved person to become his subordinate and at the same time deprive them from their abilities. With a powerful yet obedient pawn, he expects to obtain a great magic power. Well, for Dino, this was just a game for staving off his boredom, but even so, this magnificent game had been played for almost 300 years. And yet. From Voldora's words, he noticed the possibility of an even higher goal. Aspiration to improve himself has began to bud, yet his opponent was someone that can't be reached by his own power. That thought really saddens him, but even so, he felt that it was amusing. Thanks for watching I hope you all enjoyed the video and more anime episodes and manga will be on the way. If you enjoyed feel free to leave a like and subscribe.